I don't want to say there's pressure on us, but we definitely just have a, a mentality of just being one and zero each week, and that's our that was our mindset this entire week of preparing for Fort Hayes is just being one and zero this week, and you know that takes a lot of uh, discipline, um, maturity of this football team. So I think we've had a great week of practice and preparation uh, for Fort Hayes. Yeah, definitely Fort Hayes. You know they play hard, they're physical, they got some really good secondary players. So we definitely um, we'll just have to get it. All it comes down to is just execution and our coaching staff. Um, has drawn up a great game plan for us, and um, we'll just go out there and up tempo and just play play hard and play fast and uh, just ex execute. Uh, just you know, being a true freshman coming in and making some big players for us, especially that long reception he made, um, it just says a lot about him and his hard work and uh, discipline um, as a freshman. You know, getting in the the playbook and learning all his routes and and things like that. You know, he's just done a great job for us, and we're, we're expecting big things um, from him. You know, the rest of his career. Yeah, definitely. We've had some young guys stepping up, you know, Justin Brown, who went, you know, injured earlier this year, but we got Carson Profit as well. And, you know, some of those younger, younger guys, you know, Jordy Jackson, you know, those role players right now, but when, when they get their opportunity, um, they'll definitely take advantage of it. And, you know, that that's because of their hard work and, and discipline for this program. Well, I saw the ball was, it looked like it was tipped at the line of scrimmage, so I had to slow down the catch it and the defender just got lost, looked like, and just used my speed to get in the end zone. It really helped me a lot in my route running and my uh, recognizing the defenses. Kowalski's helped me out a lot. Um, well, I mean, I don't know if, don't know if you can contain both of them, but um, you can definitely try to slow them down, and that's kind of going to kind of be our game plan going into this, this week. I mean, we have plenty of uh, areas to improve on. Um, um, as far as the back end, um, we just really are working on eye discipline, you know, this week, just trying to – because they do a lot of stuff in the backfield, so just uh, high discipline. Um, yeah, definitely. I am have a good amount of confidence by this point of the season, um, trying to make uh, more plays each week. Um, our defense has really been, I think, improving. Um, we still have slip-ups at times, and obviously we're going to need to get that corrected. Yeah, that's kind of been one of our problems this year. Um, we'll have times where we're uh, doing great. We'll stop opponents, and then it'll be third and long, and we'll give up the big play. And so that's kind of been our weakness um I mean for us I mean these uh, quality opponents each week and so I mean we really just have to take it one week at a time Fort Hayes this week big opponent big rushing attack so we're, we're just focused on that right now well they're a very good football team they have a returning starter quarterback I mean I look at him as being a three-year starter he's very talented they lead the, co the conference in rushing um, they have a running back uh, that can go the distance at the drop of a hat he's very talented can you know, make guys miss. He's got great speed, um, and then defensively, they're very impressive. Just be, just how they they play very hard and they run to the football. Um, you know, they don't they don't do a whole lot, but they what they do, they do it very well. The yeah, they do with their quarterback. I mean, there's we'll see a lot of quarterback run game, and um, you know, from a defense standpoint, you definitely have to be very disciplined when you're facing that type of offense because it's similar to you know teams that run the flex bone where you know you gotta have somebody that is responsible for the quarterback in the back and you know the different looks that they can show off of it not really uh, I haven't talked to the team about that we just talk about you know my big my message to them you know has been just um, you know handling it handling it uh, one week at a time and, and uh, understanding that we got to go on the road. Very tough place to play uh, against a very good football team that you know has lost two games, uh, and they very easily, as you said, could have won both those games. So, uh, and we're coming off a you know big win. We're six and zero right now, and when you're dealing with eighteen to twenty two year old young men, you want to make sure that they're locked in each and every day. And, and the one thing that I've noticed with this football team is they've done that. Um, so we just got to continue to do that. Yeah. Well, I, I think that uh, Coach Brown's done a very good job there. It really has. Um, you know, they got very talented players. The thing that if you look at them, just with the, like this quarterback, uh, Travion, he, he's been there for, I think this is his third year. So, you know, when we first played against him two years ago, he definitely was not the player that he is right now. You know, it's just like with, with any team in this league, 
I mean, we're in the same boat. If you have a returning starter at quarterback that has a lot of experience, you got an opportunity to be a very good football team in this in this conference. All over. Well, you know, last week we get, we had, we got five of them. Yeah. So, and that was one of the things we had been talking about is uh, we were getting better defensively, but we weren't getting turnovers. So last week we were able to do that. That that was very huge for us, and you know that's vitally important when you go on the road protecting the football and then also being able to get um, to get turnovers. You know, so there's going to be a lot of people there. Their players are going to, you know, come out and, and be ready to play. I mean, they, they feel like that they very easily could be 6-0 and right now as well. So, um, you know, it's going to be a very hostile environment. And, uh, you know, we have to be, be ready for that.